Uh, battery, as always, but me and Craig bought a uh, a car battery and we wired up a USB charger on some crocodile clips to it. Um, after the battery ran out, we um, turned the engines off and we sailed for another 45 minutes. Um, really, we were we were doing two between 2.1 and 2.5 knots. But I think that was just the tides, because we weren't moving. We definitely weren't moving. There's uh, a bit of wind in the old sail, but that is just the draft created by our sailing, I think. Because when you stop, you stop. But we're... Uh, Getting pretty close to Eastbourne now. I think it's another hour or something. Now that the engine's back on, um, it's just really nice. We've been drinking some Sailor Jerry. All right. How we doing? Yeah, yeah. An hour away from our destination. An hour now, is it? Skimmer. Excellent. Right. Who are right, helmsman? Commodore? <laughs> I'll get you a hat. A nice big one. Yeah. Uh, if you watch this pull the sheep, mate, listen. You gotta come sailing with us, mate. You gotta come sailing. We're gonna go to White Cliff. Uh, never ever been on a wooden boat before and uh, it's really nice, really, really nice. It's a shame there's not more wind, so we have to run the engine. But uh, here's, uh, here's our little uh, USB charger setup. That's the good thing about being a pirate, you can just bod shit up. So where are you taking us? Where are we going for dinner tonight, then, Steve? Where do you want to go? Well, I don't know. I thought you. Uh, well, so you, so you haven't. You, you said that about a time one last time, didn't you? Yeah. So that, that, that's an option, is there? Is it? Ah, oh, so we don't know yet. Excellent. Well, that's good. We can uh, see what the options are and uh, make a decision. What an amazing day. Having a, a bit of a responsibility towards your crew, whoever they are. What are we talking about, pirates? Being a captain. Oh, yeah. We know all about that, don't we, Captain? We're getting there. No, it's true, you do have a responsibility. But it's also, you can have good fun. Like, you know. It's ultimate Same freedom. Thing, I'm responsible. It's Steve's boat, but he, because he sees me as being the skipper, although I don't have a, I have a certificate to say that I am a skipper, but I don't have anything else. So it's a case of who is responsible for his boat. So if I hit another boat or I injure somebody else or a member of my crew, I'm responsible for that. Here's what I believe. I believe you're responsible for me and I'm responsible for you. Yeah. I believe that he's responsible for me and I'm responsible for him. I believe that he's responsible for you and you are responsible for him. And what happens if you can't be responsible? Well, that's why we're I'm all responsible for each not, other. If you're a handicapped or uh, you well, then have you, an attitude that you don't want to be. Well, then you wouldn't be a very good captain. Well, you wouldn't let them on board. Well, Could you say, well they wouldn't be part of the crew, would they? I mean, let's well, be honest. they wouldn't be a crew member. I mean, well, no, sorry, no, let's say that again. Maybe let, let, No, 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 <laughs> far from it. There will be things that they will be able to do. Uh, that will be vitally important things. Probably, you know, you know, I don't say, you know, like, in, in, the, in the mess or, you know, the, you know, the galley or, or yeah. whatever. You have a but, galley? But, yeah, <laughs> actually, that's the point. We haven't, somewhere. we haven't actually been inside this boat yet, have we? So, well, not, not, with, not with a camera. I'll tell you what we do have is a wood burner. 
Yeah, so I have heard, you bastards. That's all right. We know where we're staying when it's really cold. But to be fair, ours is Arctic rated. And we've got a Herba Smasher, which means... Oh, have you got a... Um, have you seen these? There's, there's, I've seen it online, on YouTube. There's a, a lot of these boats have got these diesel... Um, right, we, we, we're going in to have a look. There is no headroom in here at all. This would have been where they stowed all the uh, oysters and such. And this is the same length as Indolo, so it really makes you appreciate how uh, how big Indolo is. But yeah, it's yeah, is it? So cool. I do like it down here, I must say. Ahoy! Ah, it's the sea monster! It's oh, it's only Captain Craig! We have a sea monster, I thought the sea monster was behind the camera! Ah, yeah, but that's the monster you can't see, not the sea monster! Uh, ah, yeah. Oh, fucking love it, pirates! It's, it's alright, Craig, you'll have to jump off in a minute, we're getting close to BTA! <laughs> Oh, oh yeah. Well, listen. Anyone that knows me knows that I get things consistently fuck. fucking wrong. Like, you know, it's minor details. You know, it's uh. It's funny that someone from um, Edenbridge has a, has a West Country accent. It's a pirate. Why well, do pirates all talk like that? Uh, I don't know. What's the Irish joke that he told us earlier? To be sure, to be to sure. To be sure, to be sure. Yeah, anyway. Bloody awesome. So we're approximately half an hour from right uh, Eastbourne now. And there's just a seal popped his head up. He won't see it on this camera. But that's pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Uh, we've taken the stay sail down now. But we've still got the main and the top sail and the jib out. We're going to start taking the sails down in a minute. That's when we'll be there. 32 and a half minutes. We're pointing out to sea a little bit. But she is quite slow to turn. You right, Helmsman? White sails only came about after the war, I think. Uh, or maybe around the war, but mainly they. What were we on about? I don't know where it was. I think it's the material. Sail colour. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah they're normally all red, aren't they? But the more modern sails are made out of white. Um, yeah. It's uh, Dacron. Is it Dacron? The sail material. Whereas this was cotton, I believe. Well, the red ones. Yeah. So these are cotton sails. Brightling, Brightling Sea, and you know, they make sails for uh, most of the um, old ships in the country um, because they can still they still hand make them to the same. Uh, uh, yeah. There's a big old boat out there, look. What's that? No, not, not one of them. There it is. You're looking at the uh, platform. The boat. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's funny, you can see it more clearly on the map. 
there's the platform we always talk about. That's right, I remember reading about that, in that, uh, and yeah, it swaps around at night as well, yeah, doesn't it? Does, it? Yeah. Which is quite mad. So you have the wind blowing on land. And it's what they call the far. sea breeze, isn't yeah. it? That's, uh, it's what we, when we talk about a sea breeze, and you know in fact, else? explain it, it quickly. Also, if it, it tends to blow at about 45 so degrees to the is land. it the higher out at sea and the low in, or the other way around? The other way around. It's, the, it's literally, the, it's a... Uh, the, the land itself warms up, which pulls, the, like you know that uh, hot air rises, yep. so the heat of the land makes the air rise, and to fill the gap of where that heat has risen, or the air has risen, it pulls the wind, it, it creates a wind by pulling the air off the sea into the land, and it generally happens at about between 30 and 45 degrees I believe. Except we don't get a bottle of rum. Don't like, get that question right. But I've got a rum with, with a with, with a. Uh, I was going to show the camera. Pepsi Max already. I get that tattoo, don't I? How long have we been sailing? How long have I been? You been sailing? We. How long we, have we been sailing? Uh, four hours. And we managed to consume a few cans of cider and nearly a bottle of rum. Well, we made quite good pirates, didn't we? Yeah, we drank too much cola, didn't we? Co oh, it's all the Coca-Cola, yeah. 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 Not enough rum. No. We should have got the extra bottle. Well, there's the boat owner. Yeah, he's the one that's drunk it all. He's responsible for us. That's yeah, right. Lock, Hang on a minute, I thought and, you... Lock, stock and barrel. No, because I'm, I'm only... This is captain. the man that claims to be the captain <laughs> until he's got a bottle of rum in his hands. He's like, mother's drunk, do what you want, lads. <laughs> you can have your boat back now, Steve. <laughs> Uh, oh, I fucking love pirates. Speaking of pirates, oh, there's one wobbling around at the front there. It's a snap on pirate. Hey! pirate. Nick, me rum over. I'd have to make myself walk the plank. Uh, don't want to be doing that. So, what have you made of uh, sailing on the wooden boat then, Chevy? Yeah, it's nice. Alright, oh, isn't it, eh? Yeah. Fucking love it, mate. I want to go and stand up the bowsprit. Well, oh, no, no. We're going to do some sails in a minute. Put them away. Yeah. Going in there somewhere. What a major day to be a pirate. Beautiful day, isn't it? Yeah. Could do with a bit more wind, but can't win them all. No. So we're gonna get there, Ian's going off. <coughs> This is why I'm so grateful that he turned up, really, because otherwise uh, we wouldn't be doing this trip, but he's got to go to a party t <coughs> tonight, so he's left his car here. He's going to drive back, we're going to stay night. I think we're going to sleep on deck, aren't we, Craig? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we're going to sleep on deck tonight, look at the stars. Amazing. Love it. Can you imagine sailing on the big pirate ship, Craig? That'd be an experience. Cool, wouldn't it, just? Maybe one day. Well, yeah. Yeah, I think we'll do the top sale. Are we taking the top sale, then? Or top sale of the please. Right, hold on a minute. I'm just going to pause it and coach him a little bit.
What was that? I said lower the topsail, Craig. <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Arr. So, so we've just taken down the topsail, rolled it up. Right, so what we got to do now, Chief? Well, this is the whole point, really, Neil, is the fact that Craig and myself are now doing all the work because you're holding the fucking camera. What's your problem? So it means you're doing nothing. So what's your problem? Well, people that do nothing have to be thrown overboard. They're useless. They're of no consequence to the voyage of this vessel. Well, sure there's something in the pirate code about that. <laughs> yeah, kill haul. That's every man for himself, plank. isn't it? <laughs> Which means there's a good chance that the two of you might end up walking <laughs> blanks. What do you reckon, Greg? So what we got to do then? Is the truth in the in the saying? Just right? explain how. Just explain how this comes down, and then I'll put it down and help you do it. You put it down. Front. So we've got a, that black ring has got to slide back to us first. Then we're going to pull in on that rope there. Yeah. And then we can unclip it. Yeah. Roll it up. And at the same time, we'll let the halyard is in front of the mast. This there. one, yeah. We pull this one in here because that's already tension. Yeah, we'll roll it in. This is coming in. We get it in and motor all the way back in. Right, with that, let's have it. We don't boy ahead. Boy ahead. Boy ahead. Keep keep port keep to the port side. Lobster. Yeah. Sick. He's got it. Now he's making the turn. He's made. Right, I'm gonna pause this. Right, hold on. Three, two, one. Right, so now we're bare pulled. Go and sit next to the helmsman. <sighs> so whereabouts is Eastbourne uh, Sovereign Harbour then? Well, where those built buildings are? Alright, <laughs> oh, okay. Down there. Oh yeah, I see it down there. Right, okay. Well, that's where we're going, pirates. What an amazing day. I must admit, drinking rum in the sun has its effects, doesn't it, eh? It does. Nothing like rushing around trying to uh, sort some sails out. But I'm looking forward to a nice dinner out tonight. You right there, boys? Am I doing a good job? Yeah. 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 I'll take that as a yes. So the sails are away now. We've just got the bow spirit in. Boys are just securing it. Um, we're not sure because we have to go for a lock, don't we? Uh, I'm not sure what the time is, so I don't know what the tide's going to be. Uh, probably low. Uh, so we will have to use a lock. Uh, well, we're not sure what side to tie our tie ropes onto yet, so uh, we'll see, but we're getting pretty close now. The boat rolls a lot more once the sails are away, because the wind holds the boat in a certain position with the sail, generally, unless it's gusting. Yeah. Now we got in the horizon there, right down in the distance. In front of the real beachy head, or the beginning of what is the real beachy head, same bit of land. Sailboats right in the distance, platforms well behind us now, down there somewhere. <sighs> awesome. Everyone should have a boat, you know. You know, they say that. What is it? People living near water are considered the happiest people on the planet generally. You couldn't disagree with that, could you? No. I'm really looking forward to sleeping under the stars tonight. Okay. Need there, pirates? I'm up on the uh, 
the boom now. The real beachy heads, all the beginnings of it in the distance. Salvo right in the distance. Can't really let go, unfortunately, but somewhere. To, whoa! Can ciders back at the helm. What a day for a daydream. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now that is the wreck that everyone talks about. Surrounded by all these boys. So, we're going to uh, go around it. But we are very nearly there, guys, as you can see. Awesome. I have no idea what that is. It's more like Bay Rock. That's where we're going. Through there. A view from the bow. Boat coming out. Boat coming out. Hard to starboard. Hard to starboard. Yeah, make your turn, Mini. Yeah. Do you reckon then, Captain? Definitely low tide. Well, this will be a first captain, wouldn't it? Yeah. We'll be awesome. Have we got to wait five minutes, have we? Interesting. That's who, excuse me. So apparently the locks are full of water, so we've got to wait five minutes. Yeah, the red lights are on, you can see.
It's in the mast in there. Right, we're just coming into the lock. We just watched it open, but I didn't have enough battery. So we've got to go in here, tie up on the left-hand side, um, and then wait. Right, I've got to go. Where I put the engines on, I just got the energy into the engine to get it going forward. Yeah, the yeah, vehicle. yeah. Well, that's what we I have to do that with Indolo. Yeah, we have to do the same with Indolo. Very, very similar, mate. Very similar. So we got this boat behind. Another yacht there. Very nice. A little speed boat. You know what I need? We need a rum. A rum. I feel your pain, brother. I do. We're getting close. Is it rum o'clock, pirates? Well, anyway, they're going to fill us up and then let us out, I suppose, or do something. Don't really know. We'll find out. All right, so I've been in here about half an hour now. The doors are just shutting. Loads of boats in here. And we'll be going out that way. Check that. It's like uh, the M25 at Russia, all right? Now we're filling up. The mast up there is going down yeah, on the it's other side. Only for six months and then we went once. It's gonna be a three hour work. There are videos because they got stopped a few times. Is that right, Neil? It's just stepped up a level. That is so cool. Wouldn't you love to have the kayak? Yeah. Oh, if we'd have had the kayak, we could have just chucked that in there, couldn't we? Done a little bit of white water and see how close we can get. So now we're going to fill up to about that line there and then uh, I'll open and we'll go through and we'll see what uh, Sovereign Harbour actually looks like. For me, it'll be the first time. They're good. It'll be the first time you've ever seen it from this side. Yeah, on a boat. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. Should open it up. We can see uh, Sovereign Harbour on the other side. Wicked. Got all the foam in between those boats. There it is, Sovereign Harbour. And we're in. There's a trimaran. Look at all these boats. Ahoy, me arties. Look at that. Beast, there's a monster. Loving that, check it out. Right, I better get ready. This is where we're spending the night, pirates. Well, that's it, pirates. We're in. We are in Sovereign Harbour. Happy days, check it out. Right, now it's beer and food. Craig, is it a pirate's life? It's a pirate's life for me. Oh.